Hey guys and welcome back to the channel where I try to cook Korean food for my wife. In the last video I made a traditional red bean filled bungapang. But today we are going to do something a little bit different. We are going to do a fusion bungapang. Actually five fusion bungapang. Um, the batter will be a little bit different for this one than in the last video. But all the details will be in the description. So follow along and maybe you can enjoy this yourself. I actually think that these are amazing. Now, a lot of you have been asking me as well about the Bungapang pan. Where did you get it? Where did you get it? So, I also put that in the description below. Click on that link and uh, and take a look. I think it's really worth it if you enjoy Bungapang as much as we do. Anyway, let's try to make these. Let's do it. Can I try? Yes. It's amazing. It tastes so good. It's still very warm. Bobang is still very warm. Ice cream and whipped cream and caramel. Just. Ugh. Are you a genius? Making apple pie bungapa. This is just can't go wrong. This can't go. Wrong. This one. this one is bacon and egg yolk. Okay. This is a great brunch menu. Mm. It goes really well. Mm. 
I think it has to be me and you want to come play. I don't even want to touch it. I think we just have to keep it as is. But it looks so delicious. Mm. I think this is one of my favorite. Who would have thought Pumapang can be this pretty? This is perfect. Mmm. Ham cheese? Ham cheese. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. This is really great. It's great actually. Mm. I didn't think it would go well. Really amazing. Mm. This is so good. Mm. I'm gonna finish them all. Mm. Mm. It's great. Mm. Mm. It goes very well with ice cream and whipped cream. It tastes like brownie with pancake around it. So it's really good. I think you love it. You love it. Mm. Mm.